So day three, weird dream last night. Paddy Hewlett was in it. And we were riding a bicycle race and he was hammering everybody. Don't know what that means. So I'd say uh, there'll be a few sore bodies today. Last night, the boys went pretty hard. Good, great session, great session, good day. Another big thing today, we've got weigh-ins of the UFC 189. I was watching the Lebowski there and the missus in the van going to work with his uh, periscope, doing his predictions. Uh, I, I, my, my predictions are the same as his, but the, the fight is a little bit different. Um, so first, we have uh, Neil Siri. I see Neil winning with a KO, his best performance so far. Starting off the night great. Then we're on to Cahill Pendred. And he's facing John Doomsday Howard. Uh, I met John Howard in Thailand in 2009. To be honest, he was a prick. <laughs> so I'm looking forward to Kyle finishing him and kicking him out of the UFC. He's got uh, three losses back to back. His coach is an asshole, and uh, he's a, he's he's quite short. So he'll have to come forward on Kyle, and Kyle will beat him up basically. Hopes he gets a good finish and uh, gets a good performance that he's been looking for since Dublin. So after that, we have Guni and uh, Brendan Thatch. Brendan Thatch is long striker. Um, good strikes, but Guni is class, and I think he'll get his range. He'll get him on the way in, take him down. Usual, hit him a few elbows. Guy gives his back, and then it's uh, then comes the darkness, because that's what Gunny does. <laughs> so I'm looking for Gunny rear naked choke. <sighs> second, second round. Yeah, second round. And the last one is the main man, the McGregor show, breaking all the records. I am going to say this is not going to be much of a fight because a fight is a backward and forward and I think a lot of people that are starting to doubt him have never seen or trained or met him or seen him the way he is and they just watch video but when you meet him it's a different kettle of fish or if you train with him or if you've been lucky to roll with him or if you're lucky to spar with him uh, or if you're lucky to be being knocked out by him um, he hits harder than anybody else He's uh, superb on the ground. Mendez, that he he's got too far to go to make that range, way too far. If he gets him down, uh, good luck with keeping him down, and good luck with doing anything with it. So I think Connor will win in the second round with devastation, and I think he'll put him away, and then they'll all wake up and they'll realise that he's for real. So I'm super super stoked. Might be a bit of a long vlog or long kind of thing but fuck it it's the day that's in it tomorrow we have fight night we are all gonna get well i am we're gonna have a big fat cigar and i'm gonna drink whiskey all night and bring the camera away we can see what the fuck happens i cannot wait
start with inhale, exhale. Inhale deeply, rise onto your toes, and stretch arms high. Exhale, lower the heels, so pull arms out and down. Again, inhale and stretch high. So that's a wrap on day three. Great session, got a few rounds in at the end. I left the boys off in a stake and a stone. All I gotta do now is wash the floor. Oh yeah, waiting on the weigh-ins, they'll be on later on. Hashtag rafter. Come on, McGregor.